It's, it's a challenge. You don't realize what things mean to you until they're actually gone away. I've had other cars I would have liked to have kept as well, but they've gone on their way to other, other homes and other owners. Getting the opportunity to bring this one back, uh, it was important. It, it wasn't obvious, but I, I had the feeling I had to bring it back. My name is Mike Nelson. I'm a race car enthusiast, and I'm using Makerspace to restore my 1960 Formula Junior. I think the concept of Makerspace is, is really wide open. We are people who like to make things, and there is no limit. For me, you're putting yourself in a position like I am now in a maker space. I'm not hiding in a garage somewhere. I'm not at home hiding in the basement. There's a level of expectation that you're here to do stuff. And I think it's good. I acquired this car back in around 1980. It was a one-off, built in Toronto by some local guys in the local garage. I think it got looked over a lot. It's like, oh yeah, interesting, interesting, but I really, people want name brand cars. So I bought it. <laughs> Girlfriend at the time wasn't impressed, but she got went along with it. And as I start looking for stuff for the cars, you know, you just can't have one race car run into another car. And then this one kind of got pushed to the side and pushed to the side and pushed to the side. And of course I had the one race car and then of course another one showed up. And so at one point I think I was up to like five or six race cars in different states of repair and whatnot. End up getting one finished, end up racing it, end up breaking it, getting another one, racing it. And, uh, and all along the way, this car sat in the back corner because it needed a lot of work. But the biggest problem, I have very little body work. I have a couple pieces and a couple of hoops that I can sort of look at, and I have to make it based on the photographs I've been able to find. I know that the car was built in Toronto by Helmut Tubler, and I know Helmut raced it for about five races in 1961, because that's all I can find in all the entry lists. And it got these great color photos. Most probably also opened in 1961, so I think everybody who was a photographer in motorsport was there every weekend snapping photos. There's probably hundreds of photos of my car still out there. I just gotta find the right person, the right photo album. There we go. Now, Helmut Tubler is still with us. He's living in Mississauga in uh, long-term care, and the goal is to get the car ready and get it out there and hopefully get a nice picture of me and Helmut together with the car again. The official Formula Junior race as part of the International Diamond Jubilee here in Canada is going to be at the Canadian Tire Motorsport Park, also known as Mosport, in Bowmanville, uh, the second week in June 2018. It's about 600 days to get the car absolutely ready to go. If there was any motivation I ever had to finish this car, I think that was really it. Saying, I gotta do this. I've had this car, you know, well, 1980, off and on, I've owned it. It's time to finish it off. 35 years, it's time to finish off a project. And I said, that's it. I'm biting the bullet. I'm putting everything else aside and just, I'm gonna focus on this. Why, why this car? I kind of could have bought any other car. Could have bought any. Could have bought one that was ready to race. Nope. I decided to buy this one because there's some, something something about the challenge. It, it's not the destination. It's the journey. I think this is one of those times, which is that is so true.